Hey guys, it's Rob J here, and in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at a new product from Ants Australia. This is the Acrylic Outworld. This is available in three sizes small, medium, and large, and they previously didn't make Outworlds, so this is new light to their lineup of 2018. This in the video is the medium, and the medium's height is 170 millimeters and the width is 180 millimeters followed by the depth is 150 millimeters all measurements are on screen if you want to pause and take a look so we're going to take a look around this outworld now and i'm going to show you starting from the top working my way down so we're going to start off with the lid itself as you can see the handle itself is embedded engraved with the logo of Ants Australia and this is a sliding top lid system with a lid that has been laser cut air holes way too small for any ant to get through and there's plenty there to provide a nice airflow and as you can see how the lid actually works it's got a slightly wider bit and will stop you pushing it closed too far so it will like lock shut at the right place and as you can see the fixed part of the sliding system is pretty simple it's a two layers of acrylic and i really must like the colored accenting on the acrylic i think it's some sort of sheet embedded but i really like the whole idea and the lid itself provides a overhang on the outworld where you can PTFE, so they shouldn't actually be on the, any part of the sliding lid. Moving down into the main outworld itself, you have a generous space to work with here that has the intrusion of the entrance. And talking of the entrance itself, this is actually one of my favourite parts of the outworld. And the reason is, it's really quite good. So let's move on to connecting it up and the connector size is for a 13mm tubing and that's a 10mm internal tube. So the also included is a white blanking plate and you take these screws out and you place the blanking plate on it and you screw it back in and essentially you will blank off the door if it's not being used so the expansion port is unnecessary and they include all the tools to do this in the box which is really rather nice now moving on to like i mentioned before my favorite part as you can see the extruding ant hill it is a 3d printed piece that does a nice incline down from the entrance port in it's a fully 3d 3d printed part and it does a gradual instead of a vertical drop that the workers probably will find okay but the queen on the move in and that sometimes hesitate and can fall but overall even if that wasn't a worry to you it is really well designed and the ants are going to really find it easier when using it to carry in food items and various other things and it's a lot more natural they don't normally come point blank vertical out as you can see here, it's a nice curve up in the 3D printed tunnel. And I think that's really a nice part of the nest. And I've not really seen anything like that before. I've seen them come in below, but that's literally just like a drill hole vertical shaft. They also come with all the accessories, including a business card, stickers, two capturing pots, some tube to get you going, and everything really that you need, as well as some tweezers. So if you've enjoyed this review, why not come and join us on our closed Facebook group where you can talk to me and other members and ask questions. And remember, no question is silly. Catch you next time guys.